<clears throat> Hello friends, it's me yet again. Um, here's my uh, latest creation. Um, Yeah, so there it is. It's not really, um, you know, it's not like I worked uh, months and months on this. It's just uh, just a small side project. Um, someone on uh, YouTube recommended that I uh, try something like this. Um, Basically what you're looking at is uh, two um, ceramic magnets, uh, they're donut shaped ones, they're uh, two and three quarter um, inches uh, each and um, yeah and these are small uh, 5000 RPM electric motors and the whole thing is on uh, bearings of course um, and it's uh, you know stuck on this um, hollow uh, brass tube and uh, yeah um, yeah the only thing uh, I would uh, say is that I had to cut um, the balsa wood um, with an exacto knife, so you know I couldn't get it uh, perfect. What I really need is um, a drill press or something like that, so that I can cut uh, you know circular pieces of balsa wood uh, perfectly, so that so that my uh, gyros are perfect. And um, you know, basically what this is, is, uh, you know, one gyro spins one way, the other spins the other way. And because they're magnets, um, you know, the top one becomes the North Pole and the bottom one becomes the South Pole. And they form a unified uh, magnetic field. And, uh, you know, what this is, is uh, it's basically just emulating uh, the universal pattern or the, um, you know, a torsion, torsion field. And uh, this is supposed to create uh, anti-gravity with fast enough uh, RPM. Of course, um, because my uh, gyros are kind of off a bit and because these motors are too small, um, you know, I'm probably not going to get I'm not getting much more than a thousand RPM, I would say. Yeah, so maybe in time I'll set it up better. But anyways, um, <coughs> I'll turn it on and play with it a little bit. 